Hey there friends, thanks for checking in at the region. Now today we're looking at the Gearson Regard MCBX Beretta M9 copy. This is getting a lot of attention. A lot of the Gearson products imported by EAA, they are getting a lot of attention. This one's in flat dark earth. They also make a blued model. Definitely has the Beretta M9 footprint. There are some things that are different. Uh, some similarities as well. Slide mounted thumb safety decocker. Gearson added G10 grips. Slight finger grooves. A different grip than the Beretta. 5.2 inch threaded barrel. All right, full pick rail right there. A uh, single action trigger that is measuring right at four and a half pounds with a short reset. The double action, extremely heavy. Some people told me that will loosen up over time. Other people said get an aftermarket uh, trigger spring for that. Not exactly sure what I'm going to do. These are my first shots with the Gearson Regard. I keep wanting to say Beretta. MSRP 567. It actually dropped a little bit. It was 588. So it's definitely a budget gun. I picked it up 400 locally. Let's see how it does. Has to hit that Not bad. Gearson now making a name for themselves. It has, it comes with eight, one 18 round mag, which is very nice. Three dot drift adjustable sights, okay? And an overall nice looking gun. I like the way that shot just there. Like I got a lot of feedback. People said it shoots very nice. But the question is, you know, how does it, Align with a Beretta M9. It's certainly cheaper. You know, 567 MSRP. I picked it up for 400 bucks on the used market or even online. You're looking at right around 450 bucks. I picked it up brand new. I thought $400 was a good deal, and I'm pretty happy with that shooting. Here we have a Beretta M9 or a 92 FS. This has aftermarket G10 grips. 15 round mags. Let's take a few shots with this. Overall feel and weight feels about the same. Let's go. All right. I'm going to shoot each of these one handed and then we'll. That was the gear sign. It's in flat dark earth. The Breta is blued. And here we go. All right, now let's get over to the table. Here we have a closer look with the uh, Gearson Regard and the Breda 92 FS. The 92 FS has a 4.9 inch barrel. The MSRP on this is $699. Here we've got a 5.2 inch threaded barrel, MSRP $567. So you're looking at a little over $100 with the MSRP on the Breda 92 FS. One of the advantages here is that it's cheaper and 18 round mags. Now 18 round mags are available with this, but it does ship with 15 round mags, very consistent with my 92X performance. It also has G10 aftermarket grips. Those who love G10 will really like the idea that Gearson ships with these G10. If we look at the slides, Breda uses the Brigadier slide, but I have to say, Gearson Regard is a very nice Breda M9 copy. We look at the grips, the controls, very close. Now you heard me complain about the double action trigger pull. Very heavy, and it is. But if we look at the Beretta, that is heavy too. Not, not quite as bad, but it, they, you know, it's a double action trigger pull. They are heavy. This one's a little heavier than average in my opinion. Look at the controls there with the slide mounted thumb safety decocker. All right, we can look at the 
slide stop pin and then the breakdown tabs it, it's a it's a very nice copy all right we can see that the gear son regard has a four slot 1913 rail no rail here on the Breda. so you look at these and you look at the msrp and you look at the features you can see that they're very close gear son actually offers you a higher capacity mag but they only offer one very consistent with budget handguns Breda usually you get two mags nice overall feel it's hard for me to say which one you should get you know i mean if you if you don't mind a copy if you don't mind a gun made in turkey this is a very nice choice i wasn't sure honestly until i shot them side by side i don't see any great shooting differences you know they're both full-size nine millimeter handguns with 4.9 and a 5.2 inch barrel that I think are advantageous for accuracy. If I had to choose one, this is just me now, I would pay the additional money to get the Beretta. I like the history of it. I like knowing that it's a Beretta. For all intents and purposes, Beretta has a fine reputation of making excellent handguns and I'm a fan. This is my first gear son. Pretty impressed with what it offers. You know, a lot of features very similar to the Breda, but you get the threaded barrel, you can run a can, you have the pick rail, you can put an accessory, and it comes with G10 grips. Excellent copy. Good job, gear son, for coming up with that. I know they came up with a, a high powered 1911s. They're making a name for themselves. They're doing a good job doing it. And I have to say, I'm pretty impressed with the shooting impressions. So far, I think that the Gearson is a quality made handgun, you know, but only time will tell. This is only my first time with the range, but I'm pretty impressed with it. And I'm always impressed with a full size Beretta. Back with the Gearson. Here we have tool ammo, steel case, cheap stuff, if anything is cheap. And then when you charge it, that thumb safety goes into effect so the first shot will be double action all right well we know that it fires the uh, cheaper stuff the steel case pretty well so which one would you choose is it the Breda FS slash M9 or the cheaper Less expensive, I should say, Gearson Regard. I'll be interested to hear what you say. Be sure to let me know in the comments. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate the thumbs up button. Thanks for watching and you guys be safe.